Hi guys, and this is how to set up your EE broadband wireless router. So what's in the box? When you get your new bright box, you open it to find a booklet. This just tells you about your billing and if you're a new customer, an existing customer. There is the broadband router and there is a keep me card. This is stuck on. This keep me card is very important. It has lots of important details on the back like passwords and your router login online. So let's put that over there. So now the only thing you can see is the actual router itself. You take it out by putting your finger into the top of the left and then take it out like that. Now underneath you'll find a step up guide on how to plug it in and everything. But you won't need this because I'm going to teach you. All the plugs of wires are also in the box. I just took this grey thing out. So, this is the plug that you plug into the socket and connect that to the power cable in the bottom router. And then here is all your equipment to connect it to your Ethernet, etc. etc. There's a bunch of Ethernet cables there. This, I would not um, take this sticker off just yet, just in case when you plug it in there's something wrong and you might not be able to return it. So, what you need to do is first get all the wires ready. So, this, the power cable. So, first you uh, unscrew the wire in there. Done. Um, these are actually a very long wire, so it can go very easy. I'll tangle there, that don't matter. Um, so this, you plug in to the back of the box, just there, next to the uh, on and off. So let's put that in there. So that's it. Now, you're thinking, how the heck am I meant to plug that in? Well, also in the box comes this. This, you just slide on nice and easily. Like, like this. So you get it in line, slide it down, hit the click. That's done. The other wire you need to put in is this long grey one here. This goes in this um, grey um, socket there, as the wire is grey. This goes in with this um, little flap on the bottom, like so. It'll click. So now you have the plug-in. And you have that in. Now, we need to go underneath. So my plugs are all under the desk. So now, let's bring this broadband router down. And it's on the floor, right here. The plug, you obviously put into a socket, like that. And this grey wire goes into your telephone line. Mine, in this case, is just up here. I already have this double adapter installed from my old Wi-Fi. It goes in again with that little floppy thing at the bottom pointing down. So now your EE broadband is connected to the internet. But first, it's got a little switch at the back. Switch that on, and it shows a green light here. That means the broadband is on. Now I will show you about the different lights. This sign here is the power. 
this little like um, cylinder sign with the arrow coming off it is broadband. Mine is flashing green, so that means I my broadband is all up and running. These two arrows are data, so that should just flash every um, five or so seconds, once or twice. Um, this on the right is um, wireless, and the wireless is on, so that's working fine. Um, this sign here is the intelligent wireless um, WPS, and um, that could be on and off, it doesn't really matter, just as long as these three are on and off, or flashing, they're fine. And then these are just for the um, Ethernet cables that you can plug into the back, but um, you shouldn't be using any if because these days you have wireless devices.